I'm studying the effect of pool fire when it's burning adjacent to an ice wall. So you can say that I'm studying fire and ice. One of the uh, conventional methods they, uh, they use for oil spill cleanup in the marine environment is the use of uh, combustion to remove the oil from surface. When you ignite the oil in an uh, environment that has ice in it, the ice will melt and that will change the burning behavior and the dynamic of cleanup tremendously. So what we had in uh, these experiments is a uh, 10 centimeter square glass tray where you have octane inside it and a three centimeter thick ice wall adjacent to that. When you're uh, imposing such a great uh, horizontal temperature difference on the liquid surface, you're inducing uh, surface tension uh, driven flows that facilitate transfer of heat from the flame toward the ice wall. That's why you see that uh, enhanced melting along the top layer of the liquid. The other effect is that because of higher density of water, that melt water will flow down. And now you have increase in level of the fluid because that water accumulation underneath the oil. And that can cause different things. For example, it can make the oil to overflow from its containment and go to somewhere else. It can extinct the fire and that's unwanted. The goal of in-situ burning is to remove as much as oil as possible.